dominating shoulder tackle. Here we go, guys. Oh, man. Falls count anywhere. And as we all know, guys, this one can oh. literally end anywhere in this arena. Suplex. What a stomp. Good oh, grief. Boom, what impact. There he goes, crashing to the floor. Beautiful technique. He's not looking like himself here. He may have to start reevaluating his game plan. I think a lot of people right now are scratching their heads wondering Man. how he let this match get so out of hand. Harsh impact. Back now inside the ring. Ah, oh, Big Show wants to fly. Bad move there. I don't know what made him think that was a good idea. Escapes trouble there. When you're one of the young guns here in WWE, you look at a matchup with a long-tenured Big Show as an opportunity to prove yourself worthy. Oh, oh, geez. Take all the wind out of you. No reverses it. The world's largest athlete is on a roll, and that's something an opponent does not want to see. Well, you bring up superstars trying to make a name for themselves by taking on the big show. I would warn the competitors of the gigantic test they're about to embark on. You'll never face such a combination of size and experience. We may see something. Oh, my gosh. That'll stop anybody. I can't believe it, Michael. And a pin attempt. And there's a kick out at one. Going to take more than that. You know, I'd say the Falls Count Anywhere match was popularized back in the Attitude Era, but before that, I remember Pat Patterson and Sergeant Slaughter's famous 1981 Alley fight, which many consider to be the precursor to Falls Count Anywhere. As Byron mentioned, the Pat Patterson Sergeant Slaughter Alley fight had many of the elements of a Falls Count Anywhere match. Most notably, I'd say, was the heavy weapon usage. Yeah, that match had everything from cowboy boots to brass knuckles, but more importantly, weren't you born in 1981, Saxton? Good point. Big Show is in position. The weapon of mass destruction! Wow, I'm just as surprised as you guys are. We got a cover. And he got a near fall out of it. Wow, I am impressed. Real quick, in case we have any newbies watching, a false count anywhere match means that this contest can literally end anywhere. Simple, right? Even Saxton can understand those rules. Already. Oh, that's just disrespect right there. I kind of like it. In describing this match, Corey, you said it can end anywhere, which means we could see this match conclude in the ring, the stands, the locker room. Heck, it could even end outside the streets. Yeah, and on top of that, it's worth noting that we may see something. That's the showstopper. That has got to be it. Even more amazing this time around, Cole. I'm not sure that this is the best time for Big Show to be playing mind games. Big Show is on a mission to prove that he can still be dominant, saying, quote, this match is important to me for redemption, for validation, to put a reminder out there of who and what I am and what I've done for the industry. Yeah. 
But he's running on fumes here. Does he have enough left in him to capital? Looking for all the glory here. Bring up that mission, big. This singles contest has a victor. Here is your winner, the Big Show. Who is that? Why is he out here right now? We all knew this situation was going to explode sooner rather than later. Show setting up. Oh my gosh! That'll stop anybody. But he's got to capitalize now. Here it comes! Choke slam! Perfectly executed, guys. 